Hey, today I'll show you how to create a car rental website similar to Enterprise or Hertz with WordPress. Such websites allow customers to rent cars for short periods of time, generally ranging from a few days to a few weeks in different parts of the country or even worldwide. In this tutorial I'm gonna use WordPress, the most popular website building platform, and HivePress, a free plugin for building any type of directory and listing websites along with its bookings extension. I'll also use the Listing Hive theme since it's a free, multi-purpose theme that has all the required features for building a car rental platform and it's fully compatible with the HivePress plugin. You can follow the link in the description to learn more about HivePress and its themes, download the Listing Hive theme or ask developers any pre-purchase questions. Ok, so let's start with the theme installation and navigate to the WordPress dashboard first. Since Listing Hive is a free theme, you can install it directly from the WordPress dashboard by going to the Appearance Themes page and then clicking Add New. Next, find it via the search bar and proceed by installing it. Finally, click on the Activate button. Once you activate the theme, you'll get a suggestion to install the HivePress plugin. Simply follow the link and then start the installation. Now click on the return link and proceed by activating HivePress. Now, if you want to enable the bookings features for card listings, it's necessary to install the bookings extension. To do that, go to the plugins add new section and click on the upload plugin button. Then select the extension zip file to upload and proceed by installing and activating it. Now let's add some extra features to your car rental website to extend its core functionality. Navigate to the HivePress extensions section. This is a list of the available HivePress extensions that you can purchase or install for free. Let's install the following extensions. Favorites – to let users bookmark the car listings. Geolocation – to enable the location-based search and Reviews to allow users to rate and review the car listings. In order to install the extension, simply click on the Install button and activate the extension once it's installed. Then follow the same steps for other extensions you want to install. In this video I'll skip the installation of other extensions since it's the same. Ok, now Let's split your website into categories depending on the vehicle type. For example, let's create sedans, vans and crossovers categories. To add a new category, navigate to the Listings Categories section. Here you can enter the category name, let it be crossovers. Here you can turn it into a subcategory by setting a parent category for it. Then. Fill in the description if necessary. And here you can upload the category image. When finished, click on the Add Category button. In the same way, you can add more categories like sedans and vans. There are no limits, so you can add as many categories as required for your car rental website. Once you are done with the categories, it's time to add some fields specific to car listings. You can add custom listing fields and search filters in the Listings Attributes section. For example, let's add the price field to allow setting the daily booking price for each car listing. Firstly, enter the attribute title, then mark it as editable to allow setting prices via the front end forms, and here select the number field type. Then mark it as filterable, sortable and select the search field type. It's better to select the number range field type to allow searching cars by the booking price range instead of some specific price. Finally, define how the field value will appear on the listing pages by setting its display format. For this custom price field, we'll add the currency symbol and the booking period here. Once you are done, click on the publish button. In the same way, you can add more custom fields depending on your website requirements. Alright, now it's time to add a new car listing and try to rent it via the website. 
For example, let's add the first listing to the Sedans category and do it from the front end to check how it's gonna work for users. To do this, go to your website, click on the Add Listing button, and select the Sedans category. Here, you can upload the listing image, Enter the listing title, let it be Ford Focus. Indicate the location. Set the price. And fill in the description. Now, you can customize the booking settings. Here you can see a few fields related to the booking restrictions. For example, you can set how many days are required prior to the peak update. Then specify the booking window that defines how many days in advance customers are able to rent. Also, you can set the minimum and the maximum rental duration if you want to avoid single day or long term rental periods. Finally, you can enable the booking requests option to accept each rental request manually. When you complete the listing form, click on the submit listing button. That's it! Now. Let's sign out and register a new account in order to check the whole workflow of renting a car as a regular customer. Simply log out of the admin account and click on the sign in button. Then click on the register button, fill in the required details and finish the registration. Once you are done with the registration, go to the Sedans category and locate our previously added listing. Now, let's try to rent it. As you can see, we cannot rent this car for more than 21 days and we cannot pick it up earlier than one day from today. So, for example, let's rent this Ford for 5 days. When you select the dates, click on the Request to Book button. As you can see, there is a redirect to the confirmation page where customers can verify all the details before sending a booking request, as well as add some notes. Keep in mind that as a website owner you can customize the confirmation page and add different custom fields if necessary. After you check all the details, click on the Send Request button. Once the booking is completed, you can manage the rental request in the My Account Bookings section. Now, let's switch back to the admin account and try to accept the rental request. Navigate to the My Account Bookings section and you'll see a pending request for rent. Let's accept this one by clicking on the Accept button. Once the rental request is accepted, the customer receives a confirmation via email. Also, a calendar feature allows you to block or unblock specific dates to make them available or unavailable for new rental requests. The calendar shows you all the upcoming rental dates, available and unavailable dates, and so on. That's all for today. So, if you want to create a car rental platform similar to Enterprise or Hertz using WordPress, Keep in mind that you can easily build it with the HivePress plugin and its bookings extension. They are both lightweight, easy to use and crazy customizable. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments or you can follow the link in the description to learn more about HivePress, its themes and extensions. Have a great day!